Hi Gemini, welcome to my channel. This is your reading for Valentine's Day. Let's see what do we have for you, Gemini. A message for Gemini. Wow, we have abundance. Okay. I feel like you are going to receive some gifts. With this cards. Let's see. A message for Gemini. And Gateway. With this card, it's like something magic is coming for you. It's going to be a good day, okay? Let's see. Oops. I have three cards. Okay. Let's see what's going on here. That's the green man. It's a green man. It's a father figure. It's the emperor. This person is very protected. It's going to help you. It's a energy. We have the great beer. The great beer is judgment. It's like a judgment call. Judgment is you growing, learning about your past mistakes. It's a connection with your soul. It's like now you are free, you are happy. You know what you have to do in your life. And we have the Queen of Pentacles. The Queen of Pentacles is like a mother. She is taking care of her family. She has a lot of abundance. Let's see what's going on here. Like for some of you, you have children. Let's see. It's a quick message. A message for Gemini. What do we have for Gemini? We have two bears here. The bear is someone very strong, successful, okay, with a lot of power. Maybe you need to have courage at this time also. Let's see. We have the Knight of Swords, it's someone with a lot of determination. Okay, someone coming for you. Mm. With a great peer judgment, we have the Eight of Cups. It's like you are choosing yourself, you are walking away from a situation, and you are move, moving on. You. You are working away from a relationship, maybe. And look at the star. The star is Aqualus energy. It's talking about hope, healing. It's also a wish come true. Let's see more what's going on here. A message for Gemini. So we have for Gemini. What is Knight of Swords? It's fast movement. Someone is taking action to be with you. lovers 
This person is loving you a lot, okay? It's your energy, Gemini, it's a lovers. Yeah, it's a connection between two people, okay? It's also talking about making a decision, making a choice. And you can see it's a lot of attraction and passion. Let's see, with the Eight of Cups. Why is the Eight of Cups for Gemini? Okay. You want stability, you want to find your match. The King of Pentacles, it's your match, we have the Queen of Pentacles here. It's your partner. This person is very mature and stable. He's thinking about his family first. Okay, like you want stability in your life, in your relationship. Let's see. Why is the Queen of Pentacles? Sorry, why is the star? Why is the star for Gemini? Okay, we have the seven of swords. You are taking a risk as this person is going to take a risk, okay? So seven of swords is also maybe some traditional betrayal. I want to know more what's going on here. Because your message is positive, get away, abundance, okay? Maybe this person is taking a risk to be with you. A message for Gemini. What do we have for Gemini? Your first cards, yes. Hmm. Feel like you've been fighting with this person. Have the whip. It's fight, conflict. And repeating but I can see love also with the lovers okay let's see we have an obstacle between you two it's a mountain cows or maybe it's talking about a long distance relationship. Let's see. Your last card, Gemini. And we have the letter card. You're going to receive some message, some news, okay, or some romantic message, okay? Let's see your last message. Because I can see a relationship but with conflicts, okay? Of judgment here, yeah, but it's your match, it's your partner, it's your soulmate. You need to have hope, okay? Gemini with a star. Because abundance is coming in your life. Last message for Gemini. So we have two cards here. A bonus is coming here. We have a cup of courtship. Okay. Courtship is the main female. A main female is you, it's a woman in your life. Okay. With courtship, some or it's you are going to date someone, it's some romance are coming for you. Okay, and we have great fortune. This card is the best card in this deck. It's abundance coming in your life. Don't give up. You need to trust the universe, Gemini. Okay, because we have the star and we have abundance twice. Gemini, this is your reading for Valentine's Day. Thank you so much for watching and being here. Take care. Bye.